Hello. Wow, I have missed you. Uh, it's been a really rough few weeks. Um, some quick updates. I am recording on a new camera. Uh, well, new phone, actually. The camera is still in the box. It's been in the box for a few weeks. And uh, so the reason why it's been in the box for a few weeks is that I had not been feeling well for a couple of weeks. A friend of mine who spent the day with me uh, towards the uh, end of August uh, convinced me it might be a good idea to go to the ER to get checked out for some shortness of breath. All day long, I'd been feeling like super weak, even my arms. I kept saying, I'm so sorry, I don't know what's wrong with me. I couldn't even, she had to use a transport chair because I was too weak to even use the roll of turf. So I figured we'd get to the ER, they'd run a few tests, you know, they might keep me a short time for observation and then they'd be like, okay, you're good. That's not what happened. Um, I ended up in ICU briefly very briefly, um, we averted a crisis. So I did have um, non-invasive mechanical ventilation. They did not need to do IVIG, but as you can see, my symptoms are not controlled, even with medication. And it's still early in the day. Um, so that is probably going to be a discussion with my neurologist at the end of the month, the neuromuscular disease specialist, actually. I should clarify, I've got a few neurologists. So this is not the field expert that diagnosed me, but the local specialist that he's referred me to because the four and a half hour ride one way just to get to the field expert and then having to be appointments and tests and then traveling back. I can't manage it. So the, uh, the specialist is an hour and a half away. So uh, at the end of the month, I'll have more update and information. Um, so obviously I'm not in the hospital anymore. I'm home. Um, incidentally, while I was in the ER and ICU, Jeffrey was um, recuperating from surgery. He's got a medical condition. Um, that's finally been diagnosed after a couple rounds of really extensive dental work. He has ankylosing of the um, teeth into the jaw. That's when the roots and soft tissue like tendons and stuff just disintegrate. Um, and the bone of the teeth fuse into the jaw. They're not really sure what causes it. So um, he and I are going to have to probably think about setting up a GoFundMe account for his future care because this will be, this will be something that he'll be dealing with um, going forward and I want him to have the best possible care. So he's also home. He's napping in the other room. And I did just want to make a short video. Um, I will be making an update video that will probably include some of my experience with the hospitalization. Um, I'm still processing that. I can say that some of that was a really bad experience and I will be talking about that from a patient advocacy standpoint, but not today. So I apologize for this kind of like unedited raw story time kind of video, but I did want to do an update on the app. My app does not show the discussion tab, but when I'm on a laptop, I see it. So sometimes if I'm not able to do um, an upload or something, or I want to just get a message out, I do post on the discussion tab. Uh, I have received some inbound comments on some older videos. So thank you if you commented on those and I apologize that I have not yet responded. Um, I will as I'm able, I do try to, I do try to respond. Um, but I think on some of these two, um, as more and more of you get involved with 
the community on my channel and, and start um, interacting with each other. Um, you know, I may start to um, focus on priority um, comments that would require a direct response from me, um, like questions to me directly, things like that. Um, we'll see what happens. But anyhow, I've definitely missed all of you. I really appreciate um, some of the YouTubers that I do follow uh, for keeping me keeping me company in the hospital. And uh, I'm looking forward to providing better quality, more exciting content. But for right now, this is the best I can do. With that, I'll see you soon and hope that you are doing as well as can be and just be gentle with yourself and pace yourself. And with that, I'll see you soon. Bye.